Hello guys, welcome to this video and in this video I'm going to show you how to add a Cisco switch to EvenG. And you need to have FileZilla so you can access uh, via SFTP or FTP your EvenG, your EvenG server. And you also need to have a way to remote or to connect via SSH to your EvenG. So let's go ahead and the first thing that I need to do is you need to have the image, which is this one right here and you have to upload it to the OBT Unilab add-ons IOL bin. So we need to add it there. So let's go ahead and go to FileZilla. I'm already connected to it. So let's go ahead and go into OBT. Then after you go into OBT, you want to go into Unilab. Then we want to go to add-ons. Then you want to go to IOL. And we want to go into bin. So now let's go ahead and go into my location where, that, where the file is which is this one right here. Let's go ahead and drag it over here. And that's going to upload it. And <clears throat> after that is uploaded, we need to fix the permissions. And while that is going on, we also need to create a file where the, where the license is going to be. And before we do that, Let's go ahead and create a file and it needs to be in the same location. So let's go ahead and create a new file. And this one is going to be called IOU keygen.py. Okay, so after that is created, we need to go ahead and via SSH, we need to go into this location right here. So if you just go ahead and copy it, and do a CD, and I'm already connected to it via SSH. So if you're using a Windows device, you can use PuTTY to connect to your EvenG. And if you're using, if you are using Linux, you can just connect to it via your terminal. So let's go ahead and we go to the location. We can do an LS, and you're going to see that we have that keygen over here. So we need to do an Nano IOU needs to be all in capital nano and over here we need to copy and paste the license so i have it saved so i'm just going to going to have it copy it and i'm just going to paste it right here there it is and after that is pasted you can just do a control x and then the yes to save it and that it is saved so after that is done what we need to do is we need to run that with python so you want to do a python I O U keygen. Oops, not Python, it's Python. Oops, is that a capital O? We don't want no capital O, lowercase O. And there we go. And that, that gives you a license over here. So what we need to do is that we want to create a new um, IOU license. And the way that you do that is you do a nano negative C I O U R C so nano negative C I O U R C and it is trying to read it let's go ahead and just uh, Control X to close that, say yes. Control S, say no. So let's go ahead and do a LS. And let's see what we have here. So we have it I O U R. So let's go ahead and do a nano again. I O U R C. And inside right here, we need to paste our license. So let's go ahead and do Control X. And the license that it gave us was this one right here. So we need to copy the license and paste it in here. So we need to do a nano I O U R C, paste the license over here, do a control X and Y to save it and then enter so that it is saved right here. And the image was done uploading. So since the image was done uploaded, what we need to do is we need to fix the permissions. So do a, we're going to do a OPT, Unilab wrappers, UNL wrapper, 
negative eight fix per missions. You can see that the the permissions were, were valid. So after that permission were valid, what we need to do is we need to go ahead and test that. So we want to go into my event G and we can just refresh it. We're going to add a new object, new node, and here it is Cisco I O L. And this one it is a layer two, so it's going to be a switch that we're going to add, switch and there it is we can say the name to just s or you can say save it to switch whatever you want save it and that's going to add it we're going to start didn't give me any errors that's good let's go ahead and press enter so we can open it and here it is we have we just added a switch and that's how you add a switch you can do enable show ip or show interfaces vlan or vlan Incomplete command show VNN one VLAN one is now there. Let's just do a show VLAN and there it is. It is a switch that we just added. So that's how you add a Cisco switch to Eve and G. Thank you guys for watching.